just to preface this video, I would like to say that this will be a montage of me unboxing all my PC parts. That means gameplay is coming very, very soon. And yeah, it's gonna be happening right here in front of you. So I will see you guys in the montage. Hey guys, I am here with the first part of the PC unboxing. It is the processor. It is the AMD X4 8060K. It is a perfect processor for my build. And yeah, I've already opened the box just to see what was in there, but I didn't really see anything like in detail and stuff. So yeah, it's 3.7 gigahertz. It can be overclocked to 4. Point gigahertz as a max. And it's a multi-core processor and that's all to say about it. Let's unbox it. So on top looks like we got the AMD pamphlet. I'm not gonna unbox the stock cooler, but right away on top is the processor. I've actually never unboxed processor, so I'm like kind of freaking out. This is my first reaction to it. So here, over here on the left hand side, or right hand side for you, I don't know, is the, a little AMD sticker, and then the processor, which is awesome. And then I can touch it because there's plastic over it. And here's the backside with all the pins on it. And then here's the stock cooler. I already said I'm not gonna unbox that. Um, yeah, I just wanted to make it short and sweet and I will see you guys with the next part. I am here again with the next unboxing and today we have the hard drive. There's nothing special about this, but I'm still gonna unbox it with you guys. Um, if I peel the sticker and then I'll open it up. It's a one terabyte Western Digital Caviar Blue. If I can get it out of the box. This little cover is on the side to keep it safe. I'm not going to take it out of its plastic as of now, but as you can see, we have the one terabyte Western Digital Blue Caviar Blue hard drive. And yeah, that was probably going to be the shortest one out of all the unboxings. And I will see you guys in the next unboxing. I am back with the third part. And it is coming from Newegg. And let me tell you, this is bigger than all of the packages. Um, I know it's not the case, but I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure it is the graphics card. So I'm actually going to be... Oops, sorry about that. I actually just woke up uh, at like 10. And then the package already came, so... Yeah, I ordered my, I'm so excited guys for the,
So guys, I'm here with the unboxing of what I don't even know what this is. Of course I fucking know what this is. It is the case. I've already opened this huge ass box as you can see up there. And it had a bunch of tissue paper in it. So yeah, like I'm gonna This shit looks sick, dude. Guys, just look at that. That's the top. I'm pretty sure. I can probably grab it by here. Guys, look at that. Let me just move this out of the way. Let's check out what we got in here. We have warranty, the course I spec installation guide and stuff like that. Then we got the other piece of styrofoam. Let's go. Okay, so now, ugh, this thing is bigger and much heavier than I thought. But so, let's open it. Wait, it, I think the bottom is a hole. Yeah, the bottom is just open. If I can get this side off the foot. Oh. My. God, guys. This shit is sexy. I want you guys to see the front. Look at this. The front looks awesome. This thing is heavy though. It's goddamn heavy. Look at it. You got the window. It's the Corsair Spec Alpha Black and Red. It's huge, guys. Okay. Honestly, this is the coolest case. It has great ventilation. This was probably my favorite ep the clip of the montage, and this really made the PC feel whole. So I will see you guys with the next clip. So guys, I am here back with the next clip. And if you can see my case is over here. Yeah, my case is right here. And so, yeah, this is the day after I opened the case. I just got my CPU cooler. It's pretty early in the morning. Well, it's actually 1.02, but I woke up at 12. Yeah. So we got some bubble wrap. I'm pretty sure this is the CPU cooler because it's pretty small and that's what I had left one of the parts I had left. I just need the motherboard and the power supply. Yep. It is the Cryorg 227. The Cryorg C... I don't know if I'm pronouncing it that. Cryorg or something like that. It's the Cryorg C7 fan. Really nice low profile fan. So let's just crack into this thing. Ooh. I like the style of it. Like, look. The fan, it's like a sleek design. I'm really liking it. Yeah, guys, I'm not going to take it out of its box all the way, but, like, look at that, guys. That's just looking fine. So let me just put these boxes over here, right? Yeah, guys, this was a short little clip, but I'm, I don't really want to take it out of its box until I really get all the parts. But when it spins, it looks so cool. And yeah, I will see you guys with the next clip. And we only have two more or three more. Something like that. Yeah. So guys, I am back with the last unboxing. It is finally done. And so I'm pretty sure this is the power supply and the motherboard. But I could be wrong. And anything else I ordered could just be coming in the mail and for some reason it's something else i do not know but so guys i am like so excited because i'm gonna try to do a time lapse of building my pc since this is the last one. Oh yeah i was right i see the power supply maybe i wasn't right about the other thing but let's check i'm trying not to get the oh dude this stuff looks sexy as shite ah sorry okay you guys can still see me so first let me just just give me a second let me get out the motherboard right here guys we have the gigabyte i can't i don't know the exact model it's right on here let me just put the package over here it is the gigabyte f2a 68 hm it's an f2 socket fm2 socket so i'm just gonna give you guys a quick little opening if i can get the scissors 
but this is definitely the unboxing I was looking for. Actually, you know what? I'm not gonna open it. You guys will see this in the build. I'm gonna leave some suspense. But yeah, the motherboard. So guys, now for the last part. I'm sorry this series has to end. But, well not series, but this little montage has to end. But it is the power supply. It actually is looking much smaller. It's the Corsair CX-550 watt. So, I explained why I was gonna get a 500, but I could not because of the prices. Check out my other video, the PC build overview, and that will explain everything. But guys, that is it for everything. I will see you guys with the next video this time.